And I want to show you something that happened just before Auburn headed to the locker room. The players came to the middle of the field and they stomped on the LSU logo, the eye of the Tiger. The officials are on the field. They threw a flag. Auburn has already been assessed a 15-yard unsportsmanlike conduct penalty. You always worry about an onside kick when you have a 15-yard penalty. Well, we will see. John Corbello has the ball teed at the 50-yard line. An unusual start, but when LSU and Auburn play, there are always unusual things that happen. And they did go with an onside kick, and it was recovered by LSU. Michael Clayton, the wide receiver. Anytime you get a 15-yard penalty, you have got to be ready for the onside kick. How about Josh Reed here? Make sure I know where he's at. Third and nine. Here comes the pressure. Lobs it to the end zone. Touchdown and gets it. Mr. Reed. Just a minute ago, Damon Duvall, the LSU band is trying to finish their halftime performance. And Duvall comes out with the special teams coach and the long snappers. The LSU band's not done, and the LSU band got upset about it, and you could see the pushing and shoving. Again, the four wide receiver set. See the blitz right up the middle. Davey gets by the first wave of tacklers. And throw it to a wide open Jarrell Myers. back to the final quarter of the SEC championship game presented by Dr. Pepper 17-16 a third and four LSU trailing by one at the 22 yard line. You know who I like on this LSU team I like Steven Peterman the left guard he's a former defensive lineman plays with a lot of passion and enthusiasm getting the crowd fired up in this third down on third down Mark retreats wants to set up a screen fires it to Josh Reed and how about the tackle and how about the effort by Josh wow. Reed. Wow. What a play by the playmaker. First down and 10 after that nine yard gain. Here's the snap. And the quarterback draw him walk inside the 10, the five. LSU has reclaimed the lead. Six twenty-five to go, third and seven LSU with the ball and the lead, and they are perched at the Tennessee 45. Four wideouts, three down for Tennessee. They will bring four. Across the middle it goes, caught! The big freshman Michael Clayton, number 14. Davis darts left. Then plunges inside the five. Matt Mock in place of an injured Rohan Davy. Dominic Davis, an injured LeBrandon Tofield. It's going to be Davis for an LSU touchdown. Just got some Gatorade dumped on him. I think he'd feel a whole lot better had the clock ran out. Randall, as time expires, lets it fly. Oh my goodness! Touchdown LSU! They win the game! They win the football game! Kentucky fans tear down a 
Now Billy Bennett, who is kicking off this year for the first time and usually kicks off directionally. Not the strongest leg on kickoffs and tries to place the ball. Henderson is one of the two deep men, Skyler Green the other. And this will be Debrie Henderson at the one. Got him and great speed. How about that for a counterpunch? What a response by Debrie Henderson. Third and four. If they had to kick the field goal now, it would be 52 yards. Michael Clayton in motion. Mark rolls out, looks deep, fires it as he is hit. He's got Skyler Green. Who else would you want at the helm at this point in the game than number 14 in the red jersey? Boy, they are taking their time getting the chain set on the far side. They just do. Here's Green. Man for man. Oh, what a play. Picked off by LSU. Corey Webster saves the day. What a play. It's goosebump time in Oxford, Mississippi. It's Ole Miss against LSU. They have played better against the run this year. Second down, quick flip right side. Clayton cuts inside, nice. gets a block, has a touchdown. Rodney Reed was out yep. there, and boy, did he clear the way. Each year, one player is chosen for the Chucky Mullins Award. They wear his numbers. You know, Northcutt has it now. Here is Henderson, and he's in for the touchdown. My goodness, Matt Mock, Debrie Henderson, 53 yards. And this will be from 36 for the tie. Cody Ridgeway is the holder, and here's Nicholas Kick on the way, and he left it out to the right. That's two. Two misses today for the guy who was the most accurate field goal kicker in the SEC before the day started. Fourth and ten. And the pressure is coming. Manning trips. Uh, he got stepped on by his own guy. It's all over. Uh, again, the inside push. Right where the two centers and the guard, it was Buckles, the left guard, who stepped on the foot of Eli Manning. But he got driven back. Chad Lavallee drove him right back into the quarterback, Eli Manning. From the Georgia Dome in Atlanta. It's football Southern style. And it's Georgia against LSU. Cross to Vincent, goes right, gets good blocks. Here comes the speed game. Jones from behind, cannot catch him. Needs another block. Thornton is hit by the official. And here is the touchdown from 87 yards away. And the one man who might have caught him was knocked down by the official, Bruce Thornton. Yep. The snapper, Brian Jordan. Thornton, uh, Neely Kelso. Safety. Well, LSU intercepted Lionel Turner. Touchdown, Tigers. Welcome to the Superdome and a cloud of controversy as the BCS selects the Oklahoma Sooners to face the number one ranked LSU Tigers in the 2004 Sugar Bowl. First down play, Vincent the freshman, breaks free in the secondary, foot race, he can go the distance, straight trips him up. At the 19 yard line, Derek Strait trips up, freshman sensation, Justin Vincent. Green in motion, has got great speed, looking for the corner, got the first down, got it turned, here he comes, the track man. Zips to the end zone for the game's first touchdown. 24 yards for Skyler Green. He's over 100 yards now for the fourth consecutive game. Wow, he one. has passed Dalton Hilliard's freshman rushing record, so he has put the new standard up for LSU. Here he comes again. Still on his feet. 
Touchdown, Vincent! Amazing performance! Intercepted! And LSU has scored on the Marcus Spears interception, the second play of the second half, and suddenly the Sooners are down two touchdowns. There we go now, fourth down and ten, some point game. We got 156. They're coming. Delayed blitz has got him at the 40-yard line. Linebacker Lionel Turner did not come on the snap. They decided to come with the delayed blitz. Jason White thought he had the comfort of a four-man rush. He should know better. Nick Saban in a crucial situation is never going to sit on the four. He's coming with the five or the six. And here came the linebacker right up the gap, and he bore into the quarterback. And Oklahoma loads up at the line of scrimmage. And Donnie Jones is going to punt it. And there's nobody back there. Game's over. And it's five, four, three, two, one, zero. Tigers are the national champion. LSU beats Oklahoma 21 to 14. Holy cow, what a game.